As we think about all the history made this year, much of that here in Colorado has had grief and sadness. So as we end the year, Nine News is committed to bring you good news stories. We call it our Colorado Strong Series. This next story is about a family in Colorado's high country working to make the lives of so many much better. High in the mountains near Steamboat Springs. Think of any household with five or six animals in it. You're going to see chaos. <laughs> There's Melissa. I'm a nurse at Yampa Valley Medical Center in Steamboat. Ken. I've worked as a paramedic. <laughs> Five dogs and a cat. And when it's time to eat, of course, it's crazy time. Down. <laughs> Sit. Down. The Rogers family stays quite busy. Yeah. Kind of who we are. We tend to adopt pets with disabilities and do everything we can to try to help them. It wasn't always like this. Seven years ago, we... Uh, uh, saw a news piece about a little dog that was born without his front legs, and they were looking for a home for him. Enter Can Do. Has a Can Do attitude that nothing's going to stop him. He'll go up steps, try to go swimming. Can Do's missing two front legs like his friend Lucy. We don't think they're any different than any other dog. He always just was on his chest. So the family who took these two in decided they'd do something about it. We started working on little devices for him. It's a lot of trial and error. Well then. Ken doesn't really have a name for it. Ready to go. Big jump. But he knows whatever it is, it works. They suddenly have more mobility than they ever have. A beautiful day for a walk. Yet for as mobile as these dogs are, their owners believe therapy. All right, your turn. Is still completely awesome. necessary. All right, you want to go to the hospital, dude? Here we go. Out on the mono? Out on the mono ski, yeah. Awesome. <laughs> Twice a month. Good boy. And we thought, wow, wouldn't can do make a nice therapy animal? Can do or Lucy? This will be fun. We'll come to the Yampa Valley Medical Center. Would you like a doggy visit today? Since they are better themselves, they have a way okay. to make others better. Can do. Huh? Come on, do we? When they see can do, though, they they oftentimes forget about what's what's wrong with them. They're just the coolest with the wheels. This is quite a special family, making life more livable. Hey, this is great. Three wheels at a time. Hey, do bug. With a can do desire. But it shows people, you know, if this dog can do it, you can do it too. Ready to go home? Ready to go home? Are you ready to go home? A huge thanks. That is such a great story. Yeah, well, thanks. A, a huge thanks, really, to 90s photojournalist Chris Shaleen for his work on that piece. And they actually help other dogs with disabilities. They've built a half a dozen or so of those devices. They call them gizmos. They don't really have a more formal name for them, but uh, they, they really are doing some great work up there in Steamboat and just making the lives of so many so much better. That is so great. You yeah. got me all tearing up oh, over no. here. That was a great story. <laughs> what a great family. That's cool Completely. that they do that. Completely. So yeah. cool. Inspiring. All right. <laughs>